everybody. Welcome to the Sienda Ribbit here. Today we're going to make gochujang chicken, another beautiful recipe from Korea. And this time we're going to grill it over uh, uh, hardwood charcoal with uh, hickory wood. Uh, we've got chicken thighs and legs off camera. Uh, we're going to have some soy sauce. We've got the gochujang uh, paste here which promises to be very delicious. I've tasted it. It is great, but we're going to do it my way, and we're going to jazz it up with this fermented red pepper paste to give it a little kick. And, of course, we've got the cheater's garlic here and the juice of two lemons. So let's get going and make the marinade. Okay, we got the entire uh, package of 17.6 ounces of the gochujang. Uh, in the bowl and now we're going to jazz it up with probably I'm going to say a half a cup of this red pepper paste and uh, they this may seem odd people but I really love this stuff mmm very tasty to that we're going to add the juice of two lemons okay and I took a spoon and took out all the seeds and stuff and so now we got the cheaters garlic and we're gonna put oh about the equivalent of two tablespoons and now we want some soy sauce and we want about two tablespoons of that too alright so let me grab a whisk and whisk this up alright so I've gone ahead and whisked this up it seems a little bit thicker than what I wanted, so I have some rice wine vinegar, and I'm going to add about that much. We'll call it a quarter, third cup. Uh, thin it out a little bit and uh, make it a little smoother. And the reason for that is because I'm going to divide this into two, and I'm going to have two Ziploc bags, uh, one chicken thighs and one legs. All right, I think I have about half the amount of um, the Goshenjang sauce in there. And so now let's massage all these thighs beautifully and put them in the fridge to marinate overnight. And I'm going to do the same uh, with a tray pack of chicken uh, legs. Here it is the next day. Um, it's about 1 o'clock in the afternoon. Uh, we've got the marinated drumsticks and chicken thighs. I took them out of Ziploc bags and uh, put them in pans because I'm gonna have to cook these on the grill in two iterations. And here we go, they're on the uh, Weber. Uh, they've been on for about, oh, let's call it 20 minutes. All right, so here we have the plated goodness of the bar barbecued Goshujang chicken legs and thighs let's go ahead and plate some up and what we have here is a delicious plate of steaming basmati rice the gochujang chicken and some pickled Asian vegetables that my wife made uh, last night with rice wine vinegar we got some cauliflower cucumber red onion sweet pepper carrots just absolutely gorgeous so uh, let's go ahead and dig in all right, this smells delicious. Um, wow, all I can say is wow, that gochujang sauce uh, just really did a number on the grill. And oh, I'm gonna try these vegetables first. We got some cauliflower. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> just gorgeous. That is a perfect accompaniment. Okay, so. Let's try some of the chicken. Oh, that skin is crispy. It's going to come off all in one piece, but that's okay. I want it. Um, oh, yeah. Oh, there we go. Okay. I'm going to get some crispy skin and some chicken. Just perfectly done. Mmm, so tender. Okay, flavors up front, smokiness. That uh, pepper paste really amped it up. 
um, a hint, uh, just a hint of sweet in the background. Definitely sesame. Sesame flavor. Mm. I can taste that fermented bean paste, and that's only because I know what I'm looking for. Otherwise, you would just say, I don't know what this tastes like, but I know I like it. It is very, very good. Um, oh, look at that steaming goodness of chicken. Um, oh, there, there's bone. Mm. Took exactly one hour uh, to cook on the grill. Very nice. I will be making this again, and I am so glad that I jazzed up that kosher jang sauce with the fermented bean paste, chili paste. It really did wonders. Um, kosher jang is fine on its own. Uh, I like it, but I really, really like that uh, hot chili paste with the fermented bean in there, and it just ramps it up. Um, thanks for watching the video, people. Hope you liked it. Take care.